Now then guys, Mitchell Wilson here and today is finally the day. We have had these tickets booked for four months, but we're finally doing it again. For the third time, me and Assad are gonna go see the man, the legend, Bugsy Malone, Manchester's finest. If you guys haven't heard of him or you don't know why he's so important to me, literally I have I've just been mad about him for about three or four years. And I just constantly keep going to see him and stuff. I just absolutely adore him. He's just, oh, he's sick. So the plan is the gig starts at seven o'clock. Bugs Malone, you know? Watch this. It's a sold out event and I just cannot wait. Me and Assad have been waiting for this for ages. And also, we were never going to turn this opportunity down. My friend Alex told me that he's doing a meet and greet at a nightclub after the gig. And obviously, me and Assad are going to get there because we've been dying to meet this man. So yeah, it's gonna be a big, big day, so let's get into it. Right, let's go meet Assad and bring him to the prison. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so Assad is pretty impressed with my room, and now I'm gonna show him. <laughs> and now I'm gonna show him the kitchen. So now it's time to get ready for the Bugs in Malone gig. Are we gonna smash it, man? Yes. Let's smash it. Yes. Three, two, one. What are we saying? Wow. Let's smash it. Wow. <laughs> what are we looking forward to, Mitch? What song are you looking forward to? Truthfully for me, mate, the song that I'm mainly looking forward to mm. is probably Pray We Don't Play. Don't you know we don't play, yeah, yeah, yeah. What song we, we looking forward to? I said for you, Bruce Wayne. Bruce Wayne. Oh, yeah, Batman thing. I'm in a black track suit. I'm on a Batman thing. Black top blows with a ski mask to match. A man can't catch with a Batman thing. Banger. So yeah, Bruce Wayne. We don't play. We're looking forward to, but it's gonna be sick anyway. But first, let's go get some Nando's. Yes. Yeah. Smash it. Nah, I think I'm gonna go for the chicken butterfly. That's what I'm saying. A few moments later. No, like seriously, I am absolutely 
fuming. We've just spent about three or four hours in illegitimate, a nightclub in Newcastle, and literally we waited so long for a VIP meet and greet with Bugsy Malone, and it didn't happen. It didn't happen, and I just want to let my, like literally, do you feel the same? Like, I just want to let my frustration out so much, and I just can't literally understand how they didn't organize it. Bugsy, like, it, it literally isn't his fault. Like, it just isn't at all. And just the fact that such poor, poor organization by some nightclub who just want to do this meet and greet is absolutely disgraceful, man. Just it's, it. a it's just bad, isn't it? Um. <clears throat> I don't know. I just feel like, I just feel rubbish now. I literally just feel like crap. And I'm just mad. But anyway. The only thing that I can take from today was just the fact that when Bugsy did come onto the stage, everyone was rushing to him, wanting to put the hand out to him and stuff. And he saw that I was wearing a Bugsy Malone top and he did look past everyone and he did shake my hand and he said, I respect that. And literally that was the only big moment that I actually had with him. And I said wasn't there at the time because he was on the phone, but for me that was massive and just everything about what just happened in that nightclub was disgraceful and I just need to calm down because I'm really getting upset about it. I, I swear, it's just bad. Tomorrow. I'm still angry, but you know, I'll carry on. Well, pretty much we've just finished work and it's the day after the Bugsy Malone gig and I'll just keep saying it now though, if you haven't listened to Bugsy Malone, please do because I absolutely adore him as an artist, like I find him so inspirational and his music just isn't amazing, it's incredible, like it's just, it's brilliant. And he's an absolutely brilliant artist and I just think he's so underrated and I just highly recommend that you do check him out because I'm telling you to. Quick side note as well, obviously after the meet and greet a lot went down, I had a lot of emotions and I was really frustrated guys, like I know in the video like I don't usually get like that. It's literally me showing my true emotions at the time, like I swear. I was so angry and upset. And I don't like doing that on camera. Cause it's just, it's not good vibes and I'm all about good vibes. But when stuff like that happens, do you know what I mean? I just, I can't, I can't rest till like, it's all sorted, do you know what I mean? Quick thing you guys should know, uh, I did message Illegitimate, the nightclub in Newcastle, and they did refund our VIP tickets. The manager did apologize on Facebook to me. He apologized through social media. He apologized to me about that we didn't get what we wanted and that it was handled incorrectly. So I respect him for that and he's given me and asset a full refund, which I rate that, so thank you very much for that. But still, if you're ever gonna do events like that again, you do need to make sure you know how you're gonna do it and how it's gonna be organized. Apart from that, the gig was absolutely insane. Like, it was just amazing, it just was. Me and Assad had an amazing time and Assad is a quality lad. He's an absolute legend. I've known him since school and it, literally we just bounce off each other so well and just things that have ever changed. So do go check him out on Instagram because he's an absolute G. Except for when he, uh, you know, he got us tickets in the balcony and not tickets standing. <laughs> but yeah, we forgive him for that. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Please do check out Bugsy Malone because I would really appreciate that and do let me know what you think. If you don't like him, so what? Not bothered. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you do guys, I hope you guys do like him and I hope you have enjoyed this video. It's something a little bit different showing you what I'm doing, what I'm interested in and stuff. So yeah, if you guys have enjoyed this video, please like, please share and subscribe to this channel if you're new. We'll catch you soon in a bit.